what is up welcome back to the channel or welcome if you're new here my name is gabby and as you can tell by the title of this video we are going to be talking about lululemon leggings in this video and doing a comparison review and try on for you so if you're new to lululemon or you're looking for your next pair of leggings hopefully this video is helpful for you to determine which style might be right for you i have done a couple of these videos in the past but wanted to do an updated version for 2024 since lululemon has changed a few of their leggings and styles and just updated their product information. So as a former Lululemon educator and a current Lululemon creator, I wanted to pass on my product knowledge to you to hopefully help you determine which style of leggings from Lululemon will be right for you. So I will have them all linked down below in the description in case you want to shop any of these items I mentioned in today's video. It does really help support my channel if you decide to shop with those links, so thank you if you do. But without further ado, let's jump right into the video. Okay, so Lululemon has really condensed their selection of leggings down into four main styles, which are the Aligns, the Wonder Trains, the Wonder Unders, and the Fast and Freeze. So I'm going to be focusing on those core styles for this video and only covering those ones. They used to have like the Base Pace and the Swift Speeds, but I feel like those are on their way out. So for the sake of this video and longevity, purposes i'm going to be focusing on those kind of main four core styles let's start off with probably the most popular style at lululemon which are the align leggings now they do come in a few different variations so obviously you have your classic align legging you have the aligns with pockets the align ribbed and the align mini flares now i wasn't sure if i was going to include the mini flares in the legging video but i think they're like tight to body still enough that I'd still consider them more of a legging than a yoga pant. So that is kind of the core variations of aligns. Now they do come out with some like seasonal variations like the align shine slash foil at christmas they have the v-waist aligns they also have low-rise aligns but these aren't really like part of their like core styles so i'm going to be focusing on the like core items so hopefully this video has a little bit more longevity so let's start off with our basic aligns now these do come in a variety of different inseam lengths all the way from 21 inches to 31 inches i personally like the 25 inches i'm about about 5'2", but I would say that these fit as a true ankle length for me. So it will depend on your inseam length, which one might be right for you. But fun fact, Lululemon does do free hemming if you do have a membership. So always take advantage of that as well. But these are your classic pair of aligns. These are made to be buttery soft, very lightweight, and they are designed for yoga, Pilates, or something of that like lighter intensity of workouts. You can also wear them kind of more day to day kind of as like lounge wear if you will however i will say that the material of this is very delicate and can pill and snag easily so that's why it is not recommended to wear these for running training working out anything high intensity i would also caution if you have zippers or if you wear like a purse or a bag that might rub against the leggings it could lead them to pilling faster and pilling is that little kind of balls of fabric that you get on your clothes so that probably will happen with these pants over time and that is because the fabric of this is brushed so basically they are like almost like rubbing the fabric already to make it that soft buttery feeling so that is why they pill easier so if you think of like a sherpa blanket you know how it's like very soft and smooth at the beginning and then as you wash it and over time it comes that like hard little balls on the end that's pretty much the same thing with your aligned leggings here so just a word of warning but other than that these are probably my favorite if you are also expecting the super high rise aligns are fantastic i also do the regular high rise which are great for pregnancy or just like day-to-day -day wear and they also come in a double lined version this is a pear and raspberry cream and you can tell that they're double lined a they'll say on the website lined for sheerness but they also will have an extra seam down the outside leg of the legging here so hopefully you can see that there so then these ones are going to feel a little bit thicker and a little bit tighter i think than like the single lined aligns but 
don't cut the lining out of these. I did make that mistake once and I would say they are lined for a reason. So any of the lighter colors are typically going to have a double lining to them and are going to feel thicker versus like your darker pair of lines. Now for sizing, I would still say true to size. I do a size two or four in my lines. My true size would be a four. Now postpartum after having a baby. However, I was a two like pre-pregnancy and I kind of refused to give up my whole line collection. So as two is still working, some people will also size down in their lines because they want it to feel a little bit more compressive, hugged in and supportive. You kind of have to play around with sizing a little bit. I personally recommend true to size. I think that helps minimize pilling, minimize snags and just like helps your leggings last a little bit longer. That is kind of the tidbit about aligns. Now I also do have a pair of aligns with pockets. I would still say true to size. However, these ones do feel tighter because because they do have added seams with the pockets. So here's what the pockets kind of look like on the side. Again, you'll be able to see this better on the try-on, but as you can see, there are a few extra seams added to the leggings here, which I would say kind of make them feel a little bit tighter, but these are honestly a great feature. It is a little bit more costly for the pockets, unfortunately, I don't know, sometimes you just want an extra pocket in your legging. So this is a great alternative. Now, I don't have any of the aligns with the ribbed pattern or texture to it because personally I'm not a fan of these. I don't find that they are as stretchy and comfortable as the regular Align material but they pretty much fit the same as the Aligns but they just have that ribbing texture to them. And then lastly for the Align franchise is the Align mini flares. Now I do get the extra short which is a 28 inch inseam versus the regular ones which are a 32 inch inseam and I honestly really like these. They're like more of a subtle flare, obviously, than the Groove Pant. So they still have like the same align details to them, but they just have a little bit of a flared bottom. And again, still same true to sizing for these ones. And I like that they're a little bit of a switch up to your regular align leggings. Okay, next up, let's chat about the new Wonder Under leggings. They recently just rebranded these. And I would say that they're pretty much nothing like the original Wonder Under leggings but let's chat about their features. Okay so first off these leggings are made from a fabric called smooth cover so it is made to feel more supported and more like hugged than your lines but not compressive like Wonder Trains which we'll chat about in a minute. These are kind of a nice in between. They are designed for lighter intensity activities like yoga, like Pilates, day-to-day -day wear and they also aren't as delicate as the lines which is something that I really like about these leggings. So it is described to be a smoothing support that feels like a second skin that hugs your body like the Luxstream did, but the kind of buttery soft feeling like the Alliance have. It is sweat wicking, quick drying, and has a four way stretch, which is really nice. And I would say that these ones have more of a matte appearance. As you can tell, like with the logo in the back, it is more of a matte logo and it kind of like blends into the pant a little bit more. So for these ones, I would still say they fit true to size. I get a size four and the 25 inch length in these. Now for the seam details, you can see that they do have a little bit more of a curved seam kind of in the front and back where the previous Wonder Unders had more of like a T seam, I call it. So like a straight across and then straight down. And this design choice was made so that they don't slip down as easily and they do stay put during your Workout, which I actually think that they do fit really nicely and I like the curve seam to them They're kind of similar to the base pace leggings as well. If you remember those unfortunately, I believe they are discontinuing that style but if you like the seams of the base paste, then you'll probably like these as well. It does have a small little drop-in back pocket at the back of the legging here. And I would say that these are a little bit thicker than the lines, but they're not like fleecy or like that thick, like a winter legging. They're just not as like light feeling. Again, they're supposed to be made to feel hugged and more supported. I honestly really like these more for like day-to-day -day wear because they aren't as like delicate as the aligns. It does say that you can train in these. However, I just feel like, I don't know, this is probably not the legging I'm going to reach for for training. It's something I'm going to reach for for like a walk, yoga, Pilates, day-to-day -day wear, things like that. I would say these ones run a little bit warmer than like my Wonder Trains per se, so I probably wouldn't reach for them for like a 
higher intense activity just because I feel like I might get too warm in these leggings but they are perfect for day-to-day -day wear all right next let's chat about the wonder trains at lululemon now these come in your basic wonder trains your wonder trains with pockets and the wonder train contour fit so let's dive in and break those down okay so here i have the regular wonder trains again a size four in these they come in various lengths from 21 inches all the way to 28 inches and these are designed for training so these ones are made from a fabric called everlux which has a dual sensation and this is lululemon's quickest drying fabric so perfect for those high intensity sweaty workouts on the inside is going to have that cool sleek feeling like luxe dream material and on the outside is going to have a kind of brushed softer feeling like the aligns these ones do have an interior draw cord so you can adjust the waist and it also has a hidden waistband pocket in the side here as well they are more of that T seam like I was talking about previously where it is straight across and straight down. Again, these are definitely going to be a more durable legging, especially because they are made for training. So they're not going to pill as quickly on you and they're like super quick drying. However, that being said, if you do have something like Velcro, like, you know, those Velcro belts or, you know, ankle weights or something that could snag the fabric, obviously there's still that risk, but these should be a lot more durable than the previous two leggings. I would definitely Definitely describe these ones as a more compressive sensation so they're going to fit tighter than the previous two leggings and they are supposed to because they are made for training with that being said I still do like a regular size 4 I find fits me the best currently personally that works for me however if you're finding your in-between sizes that's when I would recommend the contour fit so basically the contour fit is an adjusted hip to waist ratio so it's going to have a smaller waist opening with more rooms through the legs and thighs so so pre-pregnancy I did like the contour fit size 4 so basically that means it's a size 2 waist with a size 4 pant so that's when I say like if you're feeling in between sizes like size 4 fits really well in the pant area but it's just too big in the waist but the 2 fits good in the waist but a little bit too tight in the pant area contour fits are going to be right for you I actually really like that they came out with this as well and pre-pregnancy these definitely fit me the best I love these same basic material as the regular wonder trains just in a different kind of fit and then the wonder train with pockets are like your regular wonder trains but with pockets of course and I would say that those ones do feel a little bit tighter again because of the extra seams with the pockets and in the pockets they're actually like a mesh so it is still breathable as well so if you're looking for something to train that you need a pocket for those are also a great option and the last style we're going to cover in this video are the fast and freeze these are actually the fleece version of the fast and freeze which they do come out seasonally kind of during Christmas, winter time, you'll see like the brushed and the fleece version of the Fast and Freeze. However, they do off obviously have the regular ones and they did just update the style as well. I believe the seam details got updated and they added some more reflective dots to the pant so these are designed for running they are made to be compressive i still get my true size four in these and the 25 inch length these ones are the 28 inch ones just because that's what came in like the fleece version but i would probably still do the 25s in them if i had the non-fleece version what's nice about these ones is they have a ton of pockets in them so they have a back drop-in pocket and then two side pockets as well and they also have two like smaller kind of side pockets almost like they're like really shallow pockets but i guess you could still classify it as a pocket on the side they do have the adjustable drawstring in the waistband as well so that they can stay up but these are going to be perfect if you're doing cardio if you're doing running anything high intensity because they are quite compressive so they're really going to hold you in these pants are made from a fabric called new Lux, which is going to be a very lightweight sensation but very cool and sleek to the touch so they're perfect for running for cardio anything like high intensity that you need to feel held in for but at least they're going to be lightweight so they're not going to feel heavy 
I mean, obviously with the exception of like the thermal and the fleece version, those are obviously going to be thicker and they're supposed to be more of a winter running tight. That brings us to the end of this video. Thank you guys so much for watching and I hope you've learned some useful information about Lululemon leggings to help you determine which ones might be right for you. Let me know down below in the comments which legging is your favorite from Lululemon. And if you have any questions, be sure to leave those down below in the comments as well. Don't forget that I've linked all of these items in the description for you to shop. But if you made it all the way to the end of this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel for more content and hit that notification bell so you're notified when I post new videos. I do have a few more updated comparison, review, and try on videos coming for you with the defined jackets, the scubas, some shorts and skirts for summer, and the jackets. So be sure to stay tuned for those and I hope to see you in my next video. Bye guys!